Okay, so yeah, you're a home grain grower. You don't know what the hell's going on. Right. What are you looking for with grains? So these grains here, uh, for a long time, they're just going to look like a big old patch of grass in your field or your garden. But the beauty of grain is that it eventually starts to head out, which is when the grain head, uh, which you're aiming for, starts to really fill out. So the bunch right in front of me is einkorn. And uh, one of the stems, several of the stems within the bunch are gonna start to get kind of fat and build up. And you'll start to see their little, their little awns beginning. And these are just uh, the very tip top of the grain head. And the grain heads start to appear out of blades of grass called the sheaths. And after a while, they start to turn into more prominent features. And you could really tell what you're growing for. And eventually, as you can see down here, they're already gonna start drying down soon, which is, along with the head, a good indicator of uh, when you'll be harvesting it. So, how far off do you imagine these are from harvest? These grains are probably four to five weeks away from mm -hmm. harvest. Okay. Um, a good way to tell is you can, this is a variety called Sonoran White, which is well far ahead of the einkorn. You can delicately pinch one off, and if you squeeze it apart, you can tell there's not really much in there. So, as the berry progresses, you can come out here every few weeks, pick off one of these, and you can test your berry. At first it's going to be a real small little white uh, kernel. Eventually it will become uh, the soft dough stage, so you can almost press it together and squeeze a little berry of wheat. And eventually it will become what's called uh, the hard dough, so it's almost a nearly formed kernel or berry of wheat or grain. And at that point you can begin pro uh, harvesting your grain and it should dry down uh, in the shock or post-harvest. Sweet, thank you.